do you have a very concrete or is it more of a fluid concept of what you think life will be when we dis when and if we discover it? So when we think about the search for life within our solar system, for the most part, we're talking about the search for even just the tiniest of single-celled organism, the tiniest of microbe. Such a discovery would be truly revolutionary. It would transform our understanding of biology and whether or not we live in a biological universe or one in which life on Earth is some sort of biological singularity. So, uh, you know, that, that sign of life could be in the form of molecules. These are obviously toys, but they're examples of molecules that life uses. And it could be that the detection of molecules like this by some instrument on the surface of Europa or Mars or Enceladus would be what life looks like. Uh, similarly, on, on Mars, uh, the Curiosity rover and then soon the Perseverance rover will be traversing that landscape. And there is some potential that a rock like this could come into the rover's view. Those little squiggles and swirls that you see, this is a rock that it collected in Namibia. And those little uh, features that you see are the formations from some of the earliest animals on Earth that left their traces in an ancient seabed. So there's all sorts of different ways in which um, uh, life might manifest it, itself out there in our solar system, if it exists. Uh, and uh, I would be happy with even the discovery of the tiniest of microbe, but I wouldn't necessarily be surprised if there's an alien octopus out there somewhere. 